If you're anything like me, you want to be as socially responsible as possible right now. And that means making some masks. But if you're like me, that also means the only scrap fabric you own is about 17 Crown Royal bags and well, your favorite pair of shorts that you ripped last week. Fortunately, I think that'll be just enough to make some masks out of. You'll also need a sewing machine or just a needle and thread if you're patient. Uh, some elastic straps, scissors or a rotary cutter, uh, a pipe cleaner. Um, technically, you don't need the tiny little trash can, but it's adorable, so you should have it anyway. Okay, first you'll want to cut out a 9x6 piece of fabric to serve as the backing for the masks. Once you're done with that, cut the top of the Crown Royal bag off just below the cinch, and then cut a vertical line down the center of the back of the bag. Cut across the bottom and spread the fabric out, then cut this down to 9x6 as well. While you're at it, cut out two 7-inch strips of the elastic straps. Line the two pieces of fabric next to each other, with their insides out. Place a pin in each corner and one in the bottom center. Start up the sewing machine and begin about three and a half inches from the top right corner. Sew a little bit, then go back and sew a little bit more just to anchor the thread in place. Once you get near the first corner, stop sewing and take the pin out. Slide the first elastic strap in until just the edge is in the corner. Sew over it, turn the fabric, and keep going down the side. Once you get to the corner, same deal. Remove the pin, fish the other end of the strap out, and keep going. Continue around the whole edge of the mask like this until you get to about two inches from where you started. Go a little back and a little forth again to lock the thread, then cut off the string. Turn the mask inside out and smooth the edges. Cut about a two inch segment of pipe cleaner off and fold the edges back. Slip this under the fold on the inside of the top of the mask. Start the sewing machine again and go around the pipe cleaner once on each side to keep it from slipping out of place. Then, work your way around the edge again. One last step. Fold the entire mask up on itself twice and pin the folds in place. Sew along the edges, removing the pins as necessary. Once you've done this on both sides, you're done. Straps go around your ears and you can fold the pipe cleaner along your nose to get a better fit. Now, this thing isn't medical grade, but it's perfect if you just run into the store. And, you know, it'll probably make someone laugh. God knows we could all use some of that right now.